Hello, Hoda. I don't know if you've seen it yet, but if you're a fan of the Fifty Shades series, you've seen a lot of Jamie Dornan, a.k.a. Christian Grey, and he was bearing even more skin than usual when we caught up with him this week. Jamie, I got to ask you about the look right off the bat. I mean, is this a new look, a new do, or is it just your incognito trying to skate through security? No, it's for a job, so it's for uh, this Robin Hood thing I'm doing. So, um, yeah. There's a reason for it. Are Christian Grey fans uh, liking it so far? I have absolutely no idea. I'd imagine there's a few people who are disappointed. Intrigued. In Fifty Shades Darker, Christian Grey, a now heartbroken billionaire with a voracious sexual appetite, tries to lure back the woman he can't get enough of, Anastasia Steele. Christian Grey, mm -hmm. what is going on with him and with Anastasia? It's darker, but there's also a little bit more of that love story then where you see that she is winning him over. He's fallen in love with her. It's great to see Anna sort of put him at ease and we get to see a different side of Christian and, and a softer side. He, he smiles a lot more in, yes. in, in, in darker. Um, and she, yeah, make, uh, you know, I think essentially she makes him a much better person. So we yeah. get to see you have a little more fun together. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Because especially in the first movie, you know, man, like Dakota, she gets all the laughs, you know, <laughs> not really now. But you did have to do some research, right? Mm -hmm. You went to a dungeon. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You saw some s and did. What was that like? <laughs> it was interesting. It was, uh, <laughs> you know, um, I think there's so many different versions of that. And it's, you know, there's not just one. There's a million ways to kick a ball, do you know what I mean? It's like, <laughs> <laughs> there's nothing you can say that doesn't, you know, have yeah. sexual connotations. Is this that, what that happens any time you want to talk about, like, it's the movie? It's tricky, and isn't it? It's tricky because yeah. you end up, like, there's so many little holes you can fall down. Oh, Jesus, you know. <laughs> you said it. It's almost impossible to talk about this movie. Um, but, yeah. but overall, you're not a fan of Christian's approach to love. No, man, I'm not. I'm not. But I'm very understanding of it. Meanwhile, you're a dad, two lovely babies under the age of three. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, our eldest has just turned three, so yeah, it's um, total madness and carnage at home. But we love it. So are you just a normal dad on your days off when you're not acting? <sighs> you have absolutely no choice. But to be otherwise, um, they demand of you that you're dad. Changing diapers, all of that? Constantly, constantly. At least we've got one out of, uh, well, nap, yeah, diapers slash nappies. A lot of women in America right now said, oh, he changes nappies. That right there turned them on more than Christian Grey would. Really? <laughs> yeah. Well, whatever floats your boat. Well, guys, I'm also going to a masquerade ball with the entire Fifty Shades Darker cast. Tonight, I'm going to have that for you right here on Today. Tomorrow, Fifty Shades Darker from our sister company, Universal, hits theaters February 10th. Now, All right, fun with the ball. How do they compare, Natmo, the second and the first? Do you this like one? This one is more of the love story. Yeah. So there is more of a story to mm -hmm. it, whereas the first one, let's just be honest, it was all about the same. Uh -huh. So number two is better. <laughs> you know what? That was, that was unnecessary. <laughs>